Thanks for checking out my micro drawings channel. Here I'm just sharing my setup again. Some of you have probably seen it before, but just thought I'd share. I've got my Ot light, uh, my camera holder. Here's the paper I use. It's an acid-free Canson um, XL Smooth 100 weight. And it works pretty good for me. Uh, acid-free, so these pictures should last for a while. And it doesn't absorb uh, the ink a lot, which is great um, as far as not bleeding over the lines in my little drawings. There's my Copic Multiliner 0.03 and my Copic Sketch Markers. That's my uh, Ot light. It just folds up and down, you know, foot, foot and a half tall. There's my stand that holds my camera for my filming. And there's my quarter and pencil for scale. And I got a pre-cut piece of paper from the pad. So I'll get that set up and get to the drawing here. It's uh, Snoopy uh, making some popcorn for the big feast for Thanksgiving. And I usually like to start with the facial feature. In this case, I'm starting with Snoopy's nose, working around his head, adding his ear and his neck and his smile and his nose. And that way, if I start with facial features and goof up, I can just trash the picture and start over again if I need to. Again, thanks for checking out the channel. Um, please subscribe and share with others if you haven't. And so here I'm working around uh, Snoopy's ear, getting it colored in. Got to admit, not so happy with the top of his nose and how things are going here, but kind of trying to work through it. Sometimes you can just kind of work through and, and cover up some of the little mistakes. And then here I'm working on his hand holding the... Yeah, no, I just had to give up. I was getting his fingers wrong, too, and I already wasn't happy with the top of his head. So I did start over, and that happens a lot. You usually just don't see it on the videos. So here I'll let you watch for a while, and I'll join on later. Oh, all right, so pretty much have it uh, all drawn in here. There's the quarter for scale. Moving on to the Copic sketch markers, there is the broad chisel end. I use this fine tip end instead. And uh, just working right up to those uh, black lines that I drew in earlier. And a lot of times I'll end up rotating the paper so I can work that point right into the area where I need to. And again, thanks for checking out the channel. Happy Thanksgiving.